can we focus for just a second? I want you to make eye contact with me. GM, I'm Mr. Mizang, a digital artist. Mizang means anonymous in Korean. You can just call me Mizang if you feel comfortable. I will be on this screen for 10 minutes. I'm going to keep my talk as short as possible and show my artwork for the rest of the time. Gosh, that's a lot of time already. Let's get right to it. The people you see here are characters from an art collection I've been working on for a year now called Burning Souls. I outlined my plans for these pieces in this space last year. In the year since then, I've been working diligently on these pieces. Who are these characters? These are all characters living in this huge world I've created. I've been releasing work steadily, non-stop, since 2012 until now. To all the past collectors of my digital work, I gave away this piece, called The Time, for free. Collectors could then burn a certain amount of the time and exchange it for a new piece in the Burning Souls collection. They could then burn the individual pieces they collected and exchange them for these larger pieces. There are currently four chapters, and by the time this film is shown, there will probably be one last piece left, or maybe they'll all be released already. So that's Burning Souls, the reward art collection I've been focusing on for the past year. To all my past collectors, I will present a piece of work using incineration logic. Simple, right? Well, it's not simple. It's actually crazy. I had to create one animation every three days, on average, for the past year. Because of the nature of the reward artwork project, I couldn't expect to make any money while I was doing it. Why did I do this crazy thing? To explain, Let's talk a little bit about pre-burning souls. For a moment, let's go back in time. I made my debut in the crypto art scene in 2021 with a series called Modern Life is Rubbish on Super Rare. It was a huge success. Modern Life is Rubbish is an 11-part animated series that tells the story of work, life, and the ordinary lives we all lead in a fictionalized dystopia. Shout out to the biggest collector of this collection, Gabriel, more famously known by the name GB Less TS. This whole story could not have happened without him. After that, I continued to serialize my work through Nifty Gateway, Clip Drops, Playing Arts, Ghosts Project, etc., and met many collectors. All these works that started with Modern Life is Rubbish were organically intertwined into one story especially with Ghost Project. I was able to use the comic and animation formats to tell a very specific story. As a final artwork roadmap for Ghost Project, I was also able to create a 2D animation called Special Fragment. It's a three minute, 33 second animation drawn frame by frame that took me seven months to create. And it's one long piece of artwork. It was probably the most daring endeavor in the entire crypto art scene. Here's a short edit of the animation. Did you enjoy it? This story in particular from Ghost Project is going to be an infinitely expanding story through various other artists in the crypto scene in the future. And you guys in this room will be able to participate in it. As you can see, I've been able to focus on creating all of these pieces over the past few years, thanks to a number of collectors. So I wanted to give them each a piece as a thank you. That's why I created Burning Souls which I showed you at the beginning. All these characters are part of the world I created. By the time this film is shown, Burning Souls will probably be complete with about 100 pieces. 
I'm not going to explain all the logic again. All you need to know is that these wonderful images exist somewhere on the blockchain. This is the history of my work in the crypto art scene from 2021 to the present. I tried to compress it as short as possible. In fact, the last few years actually feel very short to me because I feel like I created all these works in one breath. <laughs> Sometimes it's hard to understand what time is. It disappears so quickly. I don't like the concept of time. After spending so much time on my work over the years, I'm about to take a very long break. No, of course not. I'll be right back to work on the next one. The next one might also be digital artwork. For example, I might polish up and release this Life is a Theme Park series that I haven't released as NFTs yet. It's a great piece of artwork, isn't it? A series that compares our lives and society to a fictional theme park. Otherwise, chances are I'll be focusing on your physical artwork. I recently bought a bunch of canvases and acrylic paints. Or maybe I'll make both, I don't know yet. I'm curious to see what I can create over the next year. Hopefully we can talk about the results here next year. Yes, this is my annual show. I'll be working hard on my art as always. See you next year.